Hello everyone, welcome to Sources Classes. So in this video again, we'll be continuing our discussion with respect to questions pertaining to the quarterly update section of the paper. So if we talk about the QA section this year's paper, in general, we have seen that the papers seem to be a little bit on a difficult side. That is the kind of question that we have seen being asked this year round. They seem to be, you know, more calculation intensive and also required an in-depth understanding of the subject matter just to solve them. This in turn contributed towards increasing the complexity and difficulty level of the entire paper. So what we will be doing in this particular video is that we will be focusing ourselves on the questions from the paper itself and then subsequently we will try and solve or answer this question so that whenever we come across questions such as this in any future examination we are easily able to solve the same. Okay. So now uh, having said that let us focus on the question at hand. So. In triangle ABC, BE is the median to side AC and AO is the median to side B, uh, AO is the median to BE. Okay. When extended meets BC at E. Okay. Uh, at point D. Okay. So it meets at point D. If AD is equal to 24, find OD. So let me draw the figure properly first. here okay, so this is our figure a b c this and this is equal, this two are equal. Okay, so this is our figure. Now, what we can do is that, let me draw EF parallel to AD. Okay, let me draw it here. Okay, let me draw EF parallel to AD. So here EF is parallel to AD. Okay. Now here since AE is equal to EC, so therefore EC can be written as AC by 2. Okay. And also EF will be equal to AD by 2 okay that in turns will give us 24 by 2 or 12 so uh, okay I think there might be uh, let me just elaborate upon this point okay I'll write the same thing let me just elaborate upon because I think there might be some confusion to a few viewers in this case so take triangle ADC and triangle EFC. So both these triangles are similar. Okay. So therefore I can write AC by AD equal to EC by EF. I can write this. So here AC by AD we know is 24. So EC I know it is AC by 2. EF right AC AC cancelled EF uh, cancels to 12 so therefore EF equal to 12 okay I hope it's clear now in triangle B E F we can see OD is parallel to EF because AD was parallel to EF and we know BO is equal to OE. Okay. 
Okay, so now focus on triangle BOD and triangle BEF. So both these are similar, so therefore we can write BD by BO will be equal to BF by BE. So here as BE is equal to uh, BO is equal to OE so therefore we can write BO is equal to half of BE so this will be 2BD by BE equal to BF by BE okay so therefore twice BD equal to BF here we have so therefore uh, this we can write uh, BD by BF equal to 1 by 2. So now what we need? We need OD. Okay, so if we look to find OD, OD can be written as EF by 2 because the ratio would continue. Similarly, uh, similarity, half ratio would continue. So EF in this regards, we already have as 12 by 2, that is 6 units okay option a will be our answer so i hope uh, this question is uh, clear to you how uh, let me just give an extension of this here only so in this regards uh, od uh, we, we have bd uh, by bo okay so this could have been written as bd by BF and BD by BF and similarly BO by B and finally this can the ratio could also be written as B uh, OD by EF okay the similar ratio would uh, actually continue with respect to both the triangles so in case you have any doubt with regards to the same I suggest you kindly go through the entire video and subsequently try and solve this question on your own that should give you plenty of idea with regards to the approach involved okay so now having said if you are looking for a detailed solution of the entire paper pertaining to all the section and if you have any doubt with regards to your guidance in terms of computer exam preparation or if you have any query with regards to any subject on which you feel our expertise are needed feel free to connect with us and we will be more than happy to help you also so if you like the video make sure like share and subscribe to the channel so that you keep coming up with relevant content such as this further down the line as well We'll be continuing our discussion with similar sort of questions in subsequent videos. Until then, I'm signing off. Thank you so much.